What is up guys, welcome back to another GeekerWatt video and today we're going to be looking at this truly insane, this incredible fully water cooled system with a dual loop design, harder tubing and featuring Intel's latest i7-8086K limited edition CPU with 32 gigs of water cooled memory. Oh, and we're going to be giving this away. One of you guys could be with a chance of winning this. Let's jump into some details. This system is actually built by a company called Cyberpower PC, and this sits in their Hyperliquid 2 lineup of fully water-cooled gaming PCs. They're going to be giving this system away, and there'll be a Gleam link in the description below. It's super simple to enter. And as if giving away this system wasn't enough, they're also throwing in a 100 hertz ultra wide monitor with gaming peripherals to boot uh, for a giveaway prize pot worth over five thousand pounds, which is just insane. Now Cyberpower PC are running the giveaway uh, so if you've got any questions or queries about it do hit them up on their social media which I'll link in the description below. Everyone is free to enter so you may as well just give it a go you've got nothing to lose and be in with a chance of winning just this incredible package. Now though let's take a dive into the actual hardware used in this machine. First off you'll notice it's fully water cooled. Uh, all the water cooling hardware has been kindly provided by EK uh, with hard tubing, they're really nice nickel fittings, and a dual loop design. So one loop for the CPU up here, and one for the GPU, with dual 360mm radiators, one at the top, and one at the front. Uh, on these, you'll find some Cooler Master 120mm RGB fans, which sync up nicely with the rest of the system, using the handy dandy included controller. The EK water block CPU and GPU blocks also look superb, they're RGB, and I didn't expect these to look just as good as they do. Uh, they do a really good job in terms of cooling performance, and I'll put some temperature figures on your screen now for the MSI uh, 1080 Ti and also the i7 8086K overclocked to 4.6 GHz. Finally, on the water cooling front, you'll find two uh, EK res and pump combo units, which once again are RGB and do a really nice job of actually lighting up and giving some colour to the otherwise clear fluid in the loop. The water cooling doesn't just stop there though. Uh, the actual memory in this build is Adata's brand new Spectrix D80. I reviewed this uh, just a couple of days ago now and you can find that video in the card section here. It uses essentially a water heatsink on top inside of a hermetically sealed tube uh, which avoids any leakages and is also RGB. It looks really fantastic and allows for some super fast clock speed. Four DIMMs here gives you 32 gigs of memory, which is a superb amount uh, for productivity, video editing, streaming, and also gaming as well. This system goes far deeper though than just its looks and its RGB. The aforementioned MSI 1080 Ti gives this machine some serious gaming horsepower, with 4K benchmarks coming up in just a moment's time. This paired with the Intel i7-8086K limited edition chip, and you get superb single threaded performance, overclocked out of the box and with a single core turbo of 5 GHz. The chip also features 6 cores and 12 threads, uh, which means the multi-core, the multi-thread side is also covered nicely and is going to work well for video editing applications such as DaVinci Resolve, Premiere Pro, After Effects and also game streaming with the CPU housed inside of MSI's Z370 at Gaming Pro Carbon motherboard. Another one of the RGB equipped parts in this build of course, it's got a unique aesthetic with support for dual M.2 SSDs, up to 64 gigs of RAM support as well and plenty of USB 3 and 3.1 Gen 2 10 gigabit ports. It's really got it covered and looks pretty fantastic in my opinion. Looking across to the storage configuration in this build and it's as insane uh, as all the other components with a 4 terabyte Seagate Barracuda giving you your mass storage for your movies, music, games, all that good stuff uh, paired with a 500 gigabyte uh, Western Digital Black for the more important applications and the ones you want to access a little bit quicker. Finally, the second M.2 drive and your Windows drive is a 480 gig unit uh, from Adata's XPG lineup. It's their SX800. Talking of just ridiculous parts, you actually get uh, an RGB heatsink that comes with this SSD, uh, which just looks really fantastic and something you wouldn't otherwise think about and syncs with all the rest of the components uh, really nicely and I have to commend the job that CyberPowerPC have done with this one. 
Wrapping up the spec sheet, we do also have a 1000 watt EVGA Supernova 80 plus platinum power supply, which literally sits on the bleeding edge of power supply efficiency, with plenty of headroom for future upgrades, which you can actually get Cyber Power PC to do on a system that you buy from them, as well as fantastic efficiency, meaning this thing's super quiet, doesn't really waste hardly any energy that you take from the wall in terms of heat or noise, and is fully modular, meaning you only plug in the cables you need, and you also get some fantastic Cyber Power PC sleeved cable extensions included in white, which top the build off nicely. All of the components here are housed inside Cooler Master's Cosmos C700P case. It's a really quite a big chassis, but looks superb nevertheless. With metal handles at the top and bottom, RGB lighting both inside and outside the case, good airflow options, a floating power supply mount, and also an incredibly conclusive IO. If I wanted to recommend a high-end case, it would definitely be this one. You also get curved tempered glass uh, side panels as well, which is ridiculous. Uh, the actual glass itself is curved. And I mean, Cooler Master 100% have done the original Cosmos case justice with this superb upgrade. Before we dive into some performance figures, there are just one or two more things to note. CyberPower PC actually sell a range of systems under their Hyperliquid 2 uh, lineup, and all of them can be specifically configured to your exact needs. One another 1080 Ti added in here, or Corsair RGB fans instead, they can do exactly that and facilitate that no problem. You can even customize your order to add a CyberPower PC jersey on uh, when you buy your system, if you so desire though I didn't get one, which has thwarted my uh, weekend fashion plans somewhat. You also get their conclusive warranty with three years labour, two years part, six months collect and return, and lifetime over the phone support. Finally, I must commend CyberPower's delivery policy. Uh, Water-cooled systems such as this come shrink-wrapped to a pallet and delivered by someone actually competent, rather than just thrown to a mainstream nationwide delivery company and thrown about with thousands of other meaningless parcels, if you will. Now though, let's roll some benchmarks at 4K synthetic and real world to see just how well this system performs. But I think that just about wraps it up for today's video. If you did enjoy it, you know what to do. Smash that like button, subscribe, hit me up on the social media things on your screen now. And as always, we'll see you in the next GeekyWop video. Have you entered that giveaway yet? Well, you're missing out. Come on, you've got nothing to lose. Adios. Adios.